Roger Jarman. I am president of the Historical Flight Foundation. We were over at Ypsilanti giving rides, and we had a couple show up, uh, sons, 9 and 11, and they said they really couldn't afford $1,200, and I just decided, well, let's go do kids free today. And the fact of the matter is, this airplane will not normally be filled with 50 seats, so we want to separate five uh, seats out for members. So once you're a member and the airplane comes to town, we'll have those five seats. informed onto that. It's an hour-long flight and we are certainly welcome to have you back. This happens to be a hat from the 50s, the original hat, and of course Eastern at the end wore the same basic navy blue hat. So in honor of one of our young ladies here, this is hers, and she happens to be back standing right here. I'm now Winifred Lynn. I was Winifred Schmidt and I flew with Eastern Airlines from 54 to 56 and I did the pre-inaugurals on the DC-7D in 55. And I have my picture. Which magazine is it? The Flying A. The Flying A. Mm -hmm. Great. And this is what she looked like. It hasn't changed much either, nope. has she? With her hat. And there she is today. Mutual safety. Uh, Central Park in about, in about uh, right doors. one, two, and three, four think, open. Eleven thirty or so lever. in an old four engine DC seven. Uh, give me a call when you get a chance. Lever. Down. Right, see Select the forward on brake system. Parking brake. Set. An hour long. We'll bring you probably up through the Hudson. Um, one side, which would be the left side, will be probably Manhattan, and on the right side will be the Statue of Liberty and, of course, Ellis Island. We'll be going out over the Long Island area where we flew at an altitude of 500 feet over the water. So we'll have plenty of things to see and a lot of amazing, I'm sure the planes that are flying out of JFK and LaGuardia, the pilots must have said something and said, look at that. Here's Eastern Airlines. One thing that's kind of nice and dear to my heart is I did fly for Eastern for 23 years and I was the last flight out of New York. So I'm very excited about being the first flight back to Miami again. <laughs>
Barbara Daggett. I flew for Eastern for 10 years. And this plane was one of the ones that I used to fly.